With the calling of the Twelve, Jesus' mission became twofold, to preach the coming of God's spiritual kingdom and instruct his followers by precept and example. He led them to the cities by the shores of Galilee. And on a day when they had journeyed to the countryside, a man lay ill in Capernaum, the slave and servant of a Roman centurion. Uh, the medicine. He can't swallow. Paralysis has gripped him. Well, can't you do something? If the seizure passes, and he survives, I've done all a physician can do. His life is in the hands of the Lord. If I were in Rome, I would offer sacrifices at the temple. Would your God accept a gift from a soldier of Rome? You have been kind to my people, even helped us build our synagogue. But you are a Gentile. This man is dying. The law is the law, my friend. I may not step under your roof, nor may you nor your gifts come into the temple of my people. I have prayed for him. I will again. I guess that's all anyone can do now. Unless... Unless what? I am told about a teacher from Nazareth. One called Jesus has great power to heal. Well, so I've been told, but he traveled to the south. No one knows where he went. He left Magdala yesterday, coming this way. How true the tales about him are, I cannot say. Stay with my servant, with my friend. Oh. I am poor and needy. Hasten to me, oh my God. For thou art my help and my deliverer. O oh Lord, do not tarry. I seek the man called Jesus of Nazareth. I am he. What do you wish? Sir, my servant is lying paralyzed at my home in terrible distress. I will come and heal him. I am not worthy to have you step under my roof. But only say the word, my servant will be cured. Does he think that a word spoken here will cure an illness in Capernaum? I am a man under authority, with soldiers under me. And I say to one, go, and he goes. To another, come, and he comes. And to my slave, do this, and he does it. Speak, I beg you. Speak and cure him. Truly, I say to you, not even in Israel have I found such faith. I tell you, many will come from east and west and sit at table with Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob in the kingdom of heaven, while those, the sons of the kingdom, will be cast into the outer darkness. Their men will weep and gnash their teeth. Go, be it done for you as you have believed. Master, you found the Nazarene. I did. At about the seventh hour? Yes. It was then that my mind cleared. My pain vanished. Suddenly I felt my strength returning like... like sunshine after darkness. If you had not gone to him... I owe my life to you, Master. Not to me, my friend. To the man called Jesus of Nazareth. And it came to pass.